Hello, everybody. Welcome to Public News Podcast. Here with my band Boiler Man. So I'm going to start like this. Standing ovation. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, just coming fresh off stage. Oh yeah. And uh, actually, the first podcast I ever did was with you guys. Right. And uh, right. just so everybody knows, it's pretty obvious, man. This is my favorite band that plays here. Yeah. You guys, fucking kill it. <laughs> kill it. Favorite kill place it. to play. Uh, love. Hey, go ahead, right now. Introduce yourself. So, you know, say, say hello to everybody. Um, I'm Angelo Jr. He plays guitar. <laughs> my name's Davi Ruiz. I play the bass. I'm Angelo Sr. I play guitar. Um, Floyd McKenzie on vocals. Uh, Pika, drums. Yeah, you guys say you play it, man. You guys fucking kill that shit, dude. Like, <laughs> you guys are like, you take it back, like not even like a half second pause and right into, into the next shit, man. It's relentless. It is yeah. relentless, man. It's yeah. fun to watch, dude. It really is fun to watch. Like my heartbeat. Like, relentless. You know, I see all kinds of bands, dude. I, I don't get this type of feeling. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, I love when you guys are here, man. I love when you guys play, awesome, man. man. So, I appreciate that you keep saying that, man. Yeah. 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 It's a great yeah. spot to play. Yeah. So uh, what's up with the, any new music coming out? Yes. Uh, this In a couple of weeks, we're going back in the studio. We're going to finish lead tracks on a full-length album. And uh, then next is vocals. So it's coming. It's taken us a while. We had a couple of setbacks, a couple, couple of things got in our way. But we're back on track. I'm ready to fucking roll. Yeah, man. Well, yeah. I got you, man. How's, how's the leg? Oh, fuck. It's cool. I'm still limping around like my age, but I'm doing all right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good to have you back. Yeah. yeah. So where can uh, where can people find find the music? Is it sure it's out there everywhere. Is it just under Boiler Man? Do we go where, where we're all, we're stream on all pl- on all platforms. Um, the our uh, five song EP is available on our merch table through our Bandcamp and also at Salzer's Records here in Ventura or over in Ventura. You can stream it on Spotify also. Right. Um, Please buy it. Yeah. <laughs> we don't have very many left. We don't have very many left. We don't, we didn't press very many. We're 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 running out, but that's yeah. okay. Because we've got the new record coming out. Um, it's going to take a while to get it pressed, so we're probably looking at sometime early 25 for it to actually get released. Um, and you'll know all about it because we'll probably throw a big party here. You know. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. 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 Dude, you admit it. If you guys are out there watching this, dude, I mean, you can listen to music all day, but when you see these dudes, forget it. Forget it. I mean, it's <laughs> unreal. Unreal, man. All five of you guys are like, <laughs> it's no other way, man. That's it's right. No other way. That's right. That's right. That's right. Let the music lead you. That's right. Right. So, you know, uh, this, you know, gonna, is, it was live on Facebook right now. That you know, this will go out at the end of the week, and uh, so I, you know, kind of did do some things different since last time when I interviewed you guys. I like to ask, you know, the, the artists, you know, like what inspired you. You know what I'm saying? Like, who was that person? Was it someone in the family? How did you want to pick up that guitar and you know play the drums? What made you want to do that? So, you know, I'll start with you, Junior. Go ahead, man. Go around. Well, pretty much my dad taught me everything I know, actually. That and Sepultura. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> fucking killer British thra- or a Brazilian thrash metal band. Fucking yeah. one of my biggest influences. And, you know, watching my dad grow up and growing up with my dad and him playing in bands and stuff is one of my biggest influences, yeah, too. So it's killer to be able to play in a band with him and all the other guys that he's jammed with and I've grown up with as well. It's like, it's like I'm in a band with all my family, really. Pretty yeah, awesome. I'm grateful for it. For him, man. I used to watch uh, Angelo walk him in a stroll and he'd just be headbanging. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 I was definitely raised yeah, in it. You know? yeah, I could put, a guitar, though, man. put a guitar in his hand when it was taller than him, dude. Yeah, that's yeah, cool yeah, shit. Yeah, that's his destiny. How about you, Doc? Uh, I find inspiration in pretty much anything in people, uh, in the world, things that are happening. Um, I listen to everything, I write everything, I write, you know, all, all, all types of music. Um, however, in Boiler Man, at this time, the creative fire burns the brightest in Angelo right now. And he is our creative engineer, he's our creative genius. Um, how, yeah, how... <laughs> he doesn't do shit without the soldiers, man. The soldiers will fucking bring well, it home. Questions about uh, how we're inspired and how our music is written and what, what motivates us, that's really this guy's department he could tell you all about it oh i blame it all on ace freely ace freely <laughs> yeah <laughs> oh, so we inspiration it's ace freely man all the way yeah. and uh gene simmons spitting blood all over the place all sweaty i was all into that when i was a kid i heard a story about angelo i used to fucking uh when we were put kids. colored lights in my bedroom when i was in third grade and I'd pour water all over my head and make fake guitars and jump on my bed like I was on stage and shit. <laughs> I like heard I you put lighter fluid on a, yeah. on a tennis racket and uh, lit it on fire yeah, I did that. to do the ace <laughs> Yeah, yeah. yeah it was pretty amazing, dude. 
Uh, well, like, we, my we, parents we, were really scared. Were you snorting <laughs> <were you stored, laughs> ants like Ozzy? What's that? Snorting ants? Uh, I think I've probably done that before. <laughs> <laughs> I did do that actually in sixth grade. <laughs> in the sixth grade. Yeah, 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 fuck yeah. It. Before I got introduced to drugs. <laughs> <laughs> I knew something had to go up there. Uh, something's supposed to go up there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Floyd, what about you, man? I've just you always been. Inspired by any music uh, since I was a kid, listening to the radio. Uh, mostly grew up on country stuff that my dad was listening to, but uh, actually when I was in a youngster in elementary school, I heard uh, a band playing around the corner from me, and it turned out it was Aggression. And so first time hearing that, you know, just that music, that drive, that just that, uh, that pure aggression that came out was something in me that needed to get out. And here I am now, letting out my own aggressions. Skate rock. Yeah. <laughs> How about you, man? How about you? Oh, uh, yeah, no escaping it for me, too. Um, both my parents are musicians. Everyone either sings or dances in my family, so. But um, it really didn't come to life until I met Floyd. Uh, we met each other in junior high. He used to gleek on me in class. <laughs> gleek, yeah. In the, in the order. <laughs> and come to find out, he lived okay, around the block from me, so. We became friends and um, turned me on to punk rock, all, the, yeah. all that music. And uh, yeah. my first yeah. band was with Floyd. Yeah, my first band was with Floyd, too. Yeah. He turned me on to punk rock, too. I was on the Dio and Iron Maiden. Mm -hmm. And I met him in seventh grade. And he seen I was wearing some Dio shirt. He's like, oh, you like Iron Maiden, too? I'm like, yeah. He's like, I got the new record at my house. Bring me a tape. I'll tape it for you. So he brings the tape back the next day. But he put fucking Dr. No plug in Jesus on the other side. And that fucking changed my life forever, yeah, fucking yeah. ever, dude. It changed my life, dude. And, and you're, after you're, that, dude, you're working with Dr. No now, uh, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm currently playing with them, too. Which is, it's a real honor. That's awesome, Because you know, Fred's one of my guitar heroes, so it's fucking Very pretty cool. rad. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Well, shit, man. Hey, dude, you know, I, I just want to say, you know, thank you, you guys, for, for coming here, sharing your talents. Thank you know, you. it's just... Yeah, I, I look forward to it. Every time you guys would come, I'm like, fuck, yeah, boy, man. It's man boy, we look it's forward coming. to it. <laughs> I just fucking love it, man. So, hey, you guys out there, if you have not seen Boy Man, go and see them, listen to their music, you know, support these guys, man. They are phenomenal. They, their talents are incredible, and I can't say enough about you guys, man. I really, truly really appreciate, you know, you guys, every time you play here, and you know... Just being able to know you guys, man. I appreciate you. Appreciate you. Thank you, man. Appreciate it, bro. Thanks, yeah. Yeah. Appreciate everything. All right, man. Y'all have a good night. All Talk right. to you soon. Peace. Peace. Yeah.